Hello, I'm Max Balegde. And I'm George Clark, and welcome to the Useless Hotline. TikTok wasn't working out for us, so we decided to set up our own little business. We did, and the Useless Hotline is a place where we help you with your queries, no matter how weird, disgusting, or embarrassing they are. Whenever I do that, I feel like I'm one of those, like, lawyer adverts. Like, injury lawyers you had an for accident, you. It's not your fault. Yeah, that that's how I feel, um, oh. and I enjoy it quite a bit. Yeah. Okay, but it won't always just be us. Some weeks we'll be joined by a little interviewee, a potential employee for the well, useless hotline. Like today, for example. Maybe. Oh, who if knows what's going to happen. Up. Oh, oh my gosh, right, before the interviewee comes, yeah. um, I think that we should let the listeners or viewers know that we had a very exciting meeting this morning, A very we? exciting meeting that I cannot tell you, I cannot wait to tell you the context of. Can't wait of. to tell you every single aspect of that meeting about things that may or may not be happening with this podcast in a couple of months' time. Very exciting stuff. Wow. Um, but what is it, Max Belegdi? Well, should, I, should we just say it? Yeah, okay. Right, well, what it is is basically... <gasps> Can you hear that noggity not knocking at the door? I can. Oh, he must be shame. here. Oh, oh, that's really upset me. That is a shame because we were just about to like divulge all those secrets, weren't we? We'll just have to save it for I another time. I always get in- interrupted when divulging. Yeah. Is my oh, problem. God. Right, we'll come and sit over here then because he's, okay. coming, he's coming in. Oh, my God. Wow. Oh, my God. They're coming in now. Oh, no wow. way. Who is it? Jesus. It's oh. Stephen Troy. Hi wow. <laughs> Hi. How are you feeling? job interviews like that. I haven't had many. Oh, oh. bless. The crowd goes, ah. Oh. Is that because you've just been so successful at one job? Uh, no, no. Oh. Um, oh. Believe it or not, I was just uh, useless for many years. Oh, oh well, uh, believe it or not. Well here. <laughs> hey, that's the name of this. Uh, oh, wrong credit. <laughs> this, uh, yeah. <laughs> nice. But nice. That was can really I ask good. how old you two are? <laughs> um, <laughs> what? Do you usually you have to ask that you goal, you do you usually have to ask that before you sit apart from it's across just, from someone just, on the table? It's just for my conscience. Just part right, of his okay. your honor. order. He has to ask now. Fair enough. I mean, um, I do look a good thirteen. Yeah. Um oh, I'll like, be the judge of that. I either look a good thirteen or a bad twenty five. Um, okay. But I am twenty four. So ah, okay. that's all right, that's legal. I am twenty three. Yeah. Oh. Pathetic, mate. You wanna grow up? <laughs> And oh. how old are you, Stephen? Just <laughs> invite a little boy on our podcast. <laughs> I'm, I'm 27. Ew. Oh. oh. <laughs> That's meant to be the prime of a male's life, and you respond, ooh, Max. Male? Yeah. Mm. Male? Oh, I am male. What's <laughs> <laughs> oh, the debate now? <laughs> <laughs> it's 2023. Um, you never know. Um, so... Why did you want to come down here today? Are you just looking for work, or have you been recently fired? Oh, Georgia favor. I mean, oh, yeah, right. I, uh, oh. Oh, I, nice. I want a job that inspires me. Oh, nice. And inspires others. Oh, oh. yeah. There you go. Uh, first touch on the name, Stephen tries. <laughs> um, were you renamed after the feedback you had in parents' evening? Or perhaps a, a failed rugby account. <laughs> <laughs> Good Hutzpah. Good Hutzpah. Um, I would say, Stephen tries is a. If you're in Perth, even you get that as a response. Mm. Stephen tries. That's yeah. good. That is quite good. I take that. Is it good? Yeah. Patronising or not, I'd love that. Mm. What did I, you get at Parents Evening? Uh, do you have parents first of all? Spat on. Well, sorry. Uh, <laughs> do I do. I do. Yeah. Oh, I've both. got two. Okay. Oh, wow. Going Grandparents. Well, Zilch Dead Yikes oh, That is God. pre-Covid we're talking as well Oh wow Wowzers <laughs> wow. <laughs> Right It's just like natural causes Or Do, do you yeah, want to divulge any further On how you grab Tsunami Tsunami Granddad Get away from grandpa. Japan <laughs> <laughs> Do we just oh. go to the death of his grandparents I was touching on parents the evening I mean it, I, it, it's, it's, it's a way Did it happen at parents the evening Was it a parents evening based It wasn't No No Parents evening was usually Stephen's Stevens, I was good to be honest oh, with you. Were you? Uh, oh. I can't imagine you misbehaving at school. Not at all. No. Class clown? <laughs> no, I was very quiet because I was a fat little ginger boy. Oh, so if I spoke, up, <laughs> did you say was? <laughs> I'm not a boy anymore. <laughs> <laughs> fat little ginger man. <laughs> if, if I spoke up, people would go, "Who's that?" <laughs> and then just just throw shit at me. Oh, oh that's that's upsetting. Well, before we do um, any more questions, we actually have a little bit of a trial. Um, here Ooh, with the interviewees. Stephen Trial. Stephen Trials. Um, if you Is could it? please turn to the cabinet behind you. Open it. 
uh, just be wary that yeah. uh, your mic is about to fall over. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's all right, don't you um, worry. Oh, that might. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's a professional. Yeah, just open it for us. Wow. wow. Yeah, that's there good. Go. He's doing very well so work. far. Jesus Christ. Um, and if you could please pour us all a drink. Ooh. Just, just fill us up. This is a test to see what your judgment is like. Is you think the segment. Caribbean rum would be nice. <laughs> oh, my God. Wow. Um, <laughs> would oh. it? Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, um, right. That's good. I don't know about the accent, though. Yeah. Is there a hair in that? Curse you, Chloe Burrows. Oh, what's Leaving your like? DNA here, there, everywhere. Absolute skank. Wow. <laughs> okay. Is there, what's, what's the rhyme and reason behind this? What's what's the <laughs> message behind this cocktail? Coconuts fun. Oh. oh. Lots yeah. of fun with coconuts. Are you <laughs> fond of breasts? What? Yeah. No, he's right. Why? Oh, I'm right. The psychologist in him is spot on. Absolutely. Well, you know the classic, uh, <laughs> <laughs> the classic uh, boobs or bum question. Yeah. I hate that. Love oh, a coconut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it everywhere I go. Yeah, go to Greg's. Bum. Yeah, I'm a boobs or bum man. Um, well, I'm more of a penis because um, I'm a bit homosexual. Oh, we've, a bit. we've already got over this. Yeah, only a little bit. Like Tuesday. Took me a while to get over it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hear that feedback a lot, to be honest. I don't know so you, you any more just, with this. You're just attacking with more Malibu. There is yeah, other um, options in the. Oh, sorry. I think you don't, I, have, to, you don't sorry, have to keep guys, filling. I'm so, I Fill me up. Didn't mean literally all Malibu. I think that the idea was to create a drinkable drink for us all. Oh, oh, so sorry. that's um a little bit of a. Th- oh, do you know what? Actually, no, that's that's, that's a Christmas heirloom. That, that's points. Uh, can I ask you two? What would you like with Malibu? No, honestly, <laughs> <laughs> whatever you that's desire, fair, fair. whatever you're so pleased. Yeah. Um, sure, I'll go rogue. Uh, oh. This looks fun. Oh, does oh, it? Oh wow. The other I one mean, tasted like dust, but yeah. Oh. Whoa. Fingers crossed for this. Nice bit of soil. Anyway, yeah, as you were saying, uh, breasts for me has always been a, a great little thing. Possibly was I bottle fed too soon by my mother? Mm. I don't know. Ah. Too soon? Oh, so so you? So I got taken oh, off the you breast. Have literally, I wanted. you've poured right. like a third of a seltzer between us. It's all right. Um, um, hey, that's a. We are judging you. Merry heavily. Christmas, cheers, everybody. Cheers, everybody. There we go. Cheers. cheers. Jesus Christ. There we well go. There. Let's try it. Test, <sighs> test. Mm, that's dog shit. <laughs> oh, that's fucking so, grim. It's gluten wow. free though. No, oh, it is. It's a weight off my mind. Vegan. There you go. Um, under previous employers, we've done a. What are you doing? Sorry. Uh, under previous employers, it says here uh, the side men. Have you got a good relationship with them? So Ooh, if we asked, uh, if we asked for sort of a, a reference, mm. sure, yeah. What do you think you get back? I think it would be. Dare I say glowing? Oh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Somebody put up a card behind yeah. the scenes there. Yeah, they did. <laughs> and a gun. <laughs> oh. um, uh, yeah, it would, be a <laughs> it would be a glowing review of my work. Um, Is that because it would be on fire? No, yeah, my performance oh. was. Oh. I didn't even get that out right. Wow, that was good. Um, but yeah, I think, I think I've, uh, I've wowed them. Because oh. I've prepared a joke in the past and then has blown their minds. Oh. Oh, you don't just you don't just go off the cuff, Stephen. No. Mm. Do you feel the pressure before you go on? Anymore? I did until I did a side men did the cube and it was, in my words, woeful. Uh, and at that point, that's the bar, one of my favourite one of their videos. How <laughs> dare you? The bar went from. What does yeah, that mean? Do up. the cube. Did you know the show that sounded so northern? Did the show the cube? What that mean? Oh. Cube. <laughs> With Philip cube? Schofield. Oh, like the cube. That's it. Yeah. Right. Mm. The like very same. That. Like that. So they did that in Manchester, and it was oh. uh, it was terrible. So, oh. like Harry, you prepare lines before the show. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> <laughs> you can cross that one off. <laughs> All right, we'll do that one there. there we go. Uh, um, we do, yeah. Uh, but it's. I, I I think they like what I bring to the show. They yeah. haven't had a, had me on well, you bring, ginger. You bring it's just a the few token bags. ginger. That's what he brings. Oh, yeah, well, we'll a few grams to the show. A few grams, a few lines, yeah, and just a smile. I'm very much the Molly of the oh, group. Oh, that's really oh. lovely. So that brings us on to our next question: Who's oh, the God. most, who's the most famous person you've ever seen do drugs? <laughs> what? <Ooh. laughs> I don't know. I just thought. Of <laughs> Where does that come from? I don't know. I just thought of it. A good question. Mm. Um, <laughs> <laughs> who do I throw under the bus? <laughs> it's tricky. It's tricky because uh, you could give a cold name. I don't. Th- I'm trying to think of people I've seen. Do the old smack. <laughs> that means heroin, by the way. Yeah, yeah. 
Um, None of this soft shit. <laughs> do the old smack. <laughs> <laughs> It's got to be uh, it's got to be Bradley Walsh. Oh. He was, uh, <laughs> well, he, he can't go anywhere without it, can he? Bradley no. Walsh. <laughs> no, he's, he's, there's nothing rad about heroin for any no, listeners no. or viewers. Quite sad, yeah. sadly Walsh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but he was... Uh, drugs are bad, badly Walsh. <laughs> oh. Uh, good. Yeah. Good for yeah. you. Your turn. <laughs> Madly Walsh, I've oh, got nothing here. He's guys. obsessed with coke. He's got Ma- Madly he's mad Walsh. Yeah. yeah. Beautiful. I might stop doing this, though. <laughs> no, that stays, that stays. <laughs> But I saw him uh, shooting up in Manchester, <laughs> and, <laughs> oh and I God. said, "I said, Brad, it's not clever, it's not cool, mm. and it's not clean either." You know, I've actually needle. heard that he refers to heroin as the Dark Destroyer. <laughs> oh, does he? Yeah, um, and he's had that in him a few times. Oh, well. he has. <laughs> we've, the dark destroyer. we've all seen the video. Yeah. <laughs> um, moving on. <laughs> You were also part oh, of a group yeah. called XO. Now, Max doesn't know much uh, about this side of YouTube. I don't. So I thought I'd go on a little browse, uh, and I'm going to read out a few video titles, and you just you just tell me what the video is about. Sure. <laughs> We've ja- actually got them prepared from earlier. Okay, uh, first one. Um, is Mbappe better than Adam Boltwood? <laughs> <laughs> what was that a, video about? Oh... This was a video where Lawrence McKenna, he was part of EXO, um, oh, right, he was okay. very much the creative mastermind. Wow. Um, Inspiring. Not, not very mastermind, because the oh. channel fell apart. Oh, um, masturbate. But he did a video about uh, a young man called Kylian Mbappe. All right, second video, sensing a theme. Adam Boltwood reacts badly to the Wembley Cup and pushes Cafu in the showers. Oh, I hate it when um, that happens. It's... Yeah. Yeah, um, well, that, so, that title sort of <laughs> tells you exactly what's happening in the video. Yeah. So if you if you don't know Adam Boltwood, um, right? Yes, football you, Please today. explain. <laughs> yeah, on the losing team together. But you know. oh. Adam Boltwood, you tell, is a, tell me about him. He's uh, he's a monster. Oh, I'll, I'll go to the chase. He's a he's a horrific man. <laughs> Bradley, Bradley Walsh, Walsh is back. <laughs> hey, go to the chase. <laughs> 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 Can we actually cut to an entire episode of the chase? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to the chase. Oh my god! <laughs> he's a yeah. He's a producer um, of hateful words mainly. Oh. Oh. He's also a producer of videos. And <clears throat> sorry, that drink. And he sort of got himself too involved at the Wembley Cup, which was a football tournament mm. in which. Just uh, a reminder: I will be seeing Adam Boltwood again. <laughs> that's fine. That's fine. I won't be. Oh. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, legally, you can't come that close to me anymore. Ah. Right, we've got some more here. Uh, these are these are some. He assaulted a Brazilian in the showers, by the way. Oh, and oh. I don't mean the shave on a fan. Uh, ah. <laughs> struggled over the word fanny there. <laughs> <laughs> not the first time. <laughs> right, um, oh. as you peruse our not even beverages, uh, this is a nice one. Exo versus the best on the ball player Arsene Wenger's ever seen. Yeah. Um, Max, again, I turn to you here. Yeah, go do on. You, are you aware of the best on the ball player that Arsene Wenger's ever seen? Do you I know mean, who Arsene Wenger is? Of course. Um, Arsene Wenger is obviously a world leader. Yep. Yeah. Um, many of which dictate their entire life based on his actions. So I can only assume best of the ball was a political movement in which he got multiple people to test for testicular cancer. Close. It was actually um, <laughs> Arsenal's manager. So the best on the ball player is the person who's best on the ball. That was my second guess. Yeah. yeah. I, I prefer the first who pushed first for sense. testicular cancer. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. That's not. Don't snip that bit, by the way. Oh. <laughs> 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 Wouldn't want to. Hey, oh. What we um, like. <laughs> what is another good one. Will and E tries to escape escape HMRC. That oh. was yeah. No one's <laughs> tampered with that video title. Um. <laughs> Wait, these are tampered with. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> will just like his taxes exactly yeah there we go. he's uh he's dodged taxes for many years yeah and um, we like to joke about it but then the joking stops and you go hey our nurses need paying mate oh clapping for them only does so much yeah absolutely oh, oh that's that's got a somber tone to yeah it. but very true do you know what um, um so as a result do you pledge um, I think we actually spoke about this beforehand. You we actually did. said we that did. you would pledge twenty thousand pounds to the NHS right on the podcast. Absolutely, right now. I will do that. That's so nice of you. Through the form of private healthcare with Booper. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to save the NHS twenty thousand pounds. 
<laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> oh, bless you guys. Round of, I mean, the signs just went up. Round of applause for the studio audience. Thank, Thank you. Thanks to all the nurses that came out today. What a nice Good job guy. On strike. Didn't realise many of you were gay. <laughs> hey, oh, <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't nail the line, yeah, but we yeah, all sort of got what it was. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> Another one. I like this is my personal favourite. Exo versus hashtag ad merchant. Oh, Chris MD. Yes. Chris MD. Michael Dixon. Um, Max, similar to yourself, he's blonde with a quiff. Oh, okay. I thought you were going to say blonde and a queer. Um, <laughs> um, That's on you. Both of which would have worked out. I unconfirmed. Don't know. Could be. All right, unconfirmed. Yep. Okay, well, I'll mm. be the judge of that, um, <laughs> quite frankly. Right. <laughs> Gaydar's going off. Yeah, it is. Um, is that um, a real thing? No, it's not, is it? What, what? Gaydar? Gaydar, yeah. I yes. don't think you can get it from sort of curries. No, No, I don't <laughs> think you can purchase them online. Um, but I can definitely sell, tell. I, I've, I've, sold sell. A few, I've sold a few homosexuals as I well. I can sell a time. few, yeah. Yeah, yeah. How much? Um, <laughs> but I can definitely tell. Um, nice. Yeah, so watch out. Look at you, Stephen. <laughs> so it must be me then. <laughs> <laughs> um, we've got, yeah, I like the beach. Yeah, this was. I, like, uh, I know, I know the backstory behind this one. Uh, this was I'm based on a documentary about the. You've probably seen it. Uh, <laughs> KSI versus Logan Paul boxing match. Right. Yes. And I remember the it documentary well. followed uh, the commentator from that boxing match, oh. um, which is of course you know when you when you have a big boxing match the main thing is the commentator. Of course. And this this was a documentary about the commentator's <laughs> life and his backstory. Oh bless. And one of the quotes was. Yeah, I like the beach. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the camera pans over from a beach Seriously? to him and goes, Yeah, I like the beach. <laughs> <laughs> that is just. Anyway, that's, that's actually that segment over. insanity. Oh. That's not gone very far. <laughs> Much like Exo. <laughs> R.I.P. That's rude. I mean, yes. that was you, so it doesn't really matter. Um, in the grave with Lizzie. So, Stephen, you did a degree in comedy. Yeah, yeah, yeah big time. Oh. Was that because someone said you could laugh them into bed? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't happen at off. uni, mate. Yeah. yeah. Didn't happen at uni. <laughs> but rape's not funny, <coughs> Stephen, is it? What? No, I, no one mentioned that. No. Don't know where that's come from. Hmm. <laughs> just <laughs> just, the just my gay dog going off. What? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I say things sometimes. Take that into a technician, please. Um. If Where comedy, did you study? Uh, Salford, Salford University. Oh. Not too far from home for yourself. No, it's Spider-Man not. fan. <laughs> <laughs> oh. um, but it was, uh, it was in Salford, which of course when you think of comedy, you think mm. of Salford. a shit all outside of Manchester. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and it was the only place that was doing the comedy course. And I thought, yeah, That's get me a slice of that. And, and Peter that, Kay was, uh, was the voice behind it. He was like, yeah, mm. check out this comedy course. Didn't see him oh. at all for three years. Oh. Um, yeah. False advertising. Well, he's lost a lot of weight, hasn't he? So you might not have recognised him. Maybe he was there every lecture. No, no. This was when he was still fat. Ah. Um, <laughs> Fair enough. This was pre. <laughs> was your fat dog going off? <laughs> My fat dog didn't. Fat dog, they call eyes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we are no, not sensing a fatty. Yeah. Oh, Lay no, off the no, garlic that's... bread. <laughs> he loved that when it heckled him. Um, <laughs> but no, I uh, yeah, I went to this comedy course, and looking back, it was actually quite good in terms of uh, meeting the people there. Mm. Um, but anyone, anyone successful? Yeah. Um, <laughs> you know, because we're not sitting in front of any of those. Yeah. Oh. Uh, uh, there was uh, there was Jamali Maddox who's now on Nevermind the Buzzcocks. Oh uh, wow! Pretty good. Oh, yeah, uh, shoot you up. And uh, <laughs> and Josh Jones who's uh, now uh, uh, Tom Jones' big... son. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> and then and then probably me ranking third. Oh, oh. but I'm here. Yeah. It's better to be wanking. When I say I'm here, I, I don't mean, mean I'm here. I mean I here in life. Yeah. <laughs> Look um, at me where I am here. <laughs> not at all. If you ooh, <laughs> bloody hell, why do I lean into the mic? I don't, I don't know. know but I enjoyed it. Here's that. Um, yeah. If comedy wasn't the thing, sure. What would it have been? Why'd you go like that? Eliminate to the ears. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking Dumbo sidekick. <laughs> Cheers, George. Maybe you could be a trophy. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, maybe. Yeah. I like that. <laughs> you won't go near me then. <laughs> <laughs> mm. <laughs> that was short. I just called George a loser. <laughs> <laughs> I would say, oh god. Well, the problem is I wanted to be a comedian since I was six. Oh, oh. you still want to be one then? Fuck off, George, <laughs> yeah? Since you were six, what made you decide that Parents divorce. Oh, so your parents are divorced. Yeah. And he made right. divorce. And your grandparents are dead. 
Yeah, wow. that, that so wasn't the, okay. just, it just wasn't remember the same the, time. Remember the trauma. Right. Sorry. <laughs> That's it. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Sorry, yeah, I was just double checking. Spencer Owen would call that a misery compiler. That's <laughs> <laughs> great reference. <laughs> Max loves that. Well, I Completely love that. Clueless. I love it when, I mean, Spencer Owen famous for doing this. Yeah, which yeah. is, of course, a... Which is, of course, sign language for getting kicked in the kneecaps. Ooh. Could be. Yeah. Could be. Close. A football club called Hashtag United. Well, yeah, answer. again, that was my second. I'd go with that one. Thank mm. you. Um, so that's very interesting then. So at six years what old, what, about, what, so you, oh. yeah, your parents was divorced and then it sparked and then it was, this uh, humour. It was, uh, went, that's more funny. D- <laughs> <laughs> it was more I just wanted to. <laughs> <laughs> Lol. <laughs> I'm right, going to use that. Um, <laughs> Take right. the L, Dad. Right, so Stephen, me and your father have made a decision. <laughs> <laughs> Lol. <laughs> Oh God, bless. Um, but yeah, no, I uh, I needed attention. Um, yeah, probably from a therapist, but instead oh. I, it was from the other people in my class. Oh, uh, started doing impressions. Uh, oh. I, give us st- one. I stopped that um, at the age of ten because I realised it's childish and yeah. pathetic, and anyone who does and, impressions past that age is a twat. Yeah, and and the racism, <laughs> of course. <laughs> I, I didn't always do Lenny Henry. Oh, um, <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> But then, uh, then yeah, I uh, I just said I'm gonna do comedy. Oh. I'm still chasing that dream. Oh bless, bless him. Yeah. That's All right. Um, also here we've got uh, unlike Jamie Lynch, we do care about your past and your history. Mm-hmm. Nice. So um, we, we found don't. this picture of you online, and we'd love for you to explain it, please. Oh god, it's here. coming on through. That doesn't work. I wish it did. That'd be great. Yeah. I think we used to use these computers in. Uh, in primary school? In your university course. <laughs> oh, fucking hell, we dream of these. <laughs> That'll explain the style of comedy. <laughs> <laughs> Ancient. <laughs> oh, gosh. <are> <laughs> Sorry, just choking on the humour. Is this actually <laughs> coming out? Yeah, of course wow. it is. No just expense like spared. I shouldn't have hey. used that phrase. Just like me in 2017. Great year. Yeah. Whoa. Great year for coming out. For all the 2017 fans out there, this one's for you. Um, what happened out, there? I think it was a good year. Yeah. Uh, you're friends with uh, Jade from Little Mix, aren't you? Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, great small talk idea there. <laughs> well, no, I. Uh, oh. I had a big crush on her for a while. Oh wow! Um, I used to think that I did, but then I realised I was deeply homosexual, and I, I just like liked her hair. I'm still waiting for that. Yeah, let's, let's, it let's comes. Stop. Come in there. Stop flirting. I've got yeah, a bloody good story about this. Oh uh, right, right, okay. Can you explain that for me, please? I uh, I messaged okay. Alex Oxlade Chamberlain and said, "How do you uh, how do you get with a, a lady from Little Mix?" Oh wait, sorry, you messaged who? This Alex Oxlade Chamberlain. Oh, um, who's partner of yes. Perry Edwards. I mean, Perry, I know that actually. <laughs> Over there. Yes. Hello, Perry. Perry, away, but thanks away. for coming. Maybe um, we'll have you on one day. But it was Jade Jade Thurwell's ex pre Little Mick. No, not the Little the singer Mix. Rizzle Kicks. Um, oh, yes. that that guy. He he replied to me. Oh, um, sort of taking the piss, and I said, "I want to take Jade to a, a Toby Carvery." He then replied that night with them two in Toby Carvery. Did he actually? Yeah. Well, yeah. So he's her current boyfriend. No, he's not pre pre Rizzle Kicks. Oh. So they were together before. It was, a, it was a different. It was a different singer, I think. Yeah. yeah, no. This what? is interesting. wait, wait, wait. I need to dissect what you just said. It wasn't Jordan Stevens. I'll tell you that for free. So you just said I'm that not the, this the the guy from oh, so you're saying pre her person who she's with now, yeah, Jordan. Yeah. Right, I understand. So we're ex boyfriend. Yeah, sure. Right. Oh. So, yeah, sure. So Unless you DM on Jordan Stevens. <laughs> Scoop. Wow. Right. So you DM wait you DM'd <laughs> Alex. I didn't DM. No, I, put, I posted this publicly for the, uh, right, for the okay. attention. I understand. Fair enough. I mean, back to the divorce. Yeah, so it all, true. It, it all, all circles, circles back. back. Wow. Wow. Northern. They both talked about a circle circles. on my mother's back. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> what is that saying? <laughs> Father! Yeah. Ready, rest of the coffee. Right, it's, um, <laughs> yeah, if you could please explain, you could explain, explain this. that for us. Uh, but not in too really much detail. It's a job interview, is it? It's more of a police investigation. Yeah. The pictures are what I think it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> please explain it in not too much detail because I don't want to get an erection. <laughs> this is me holding what? Uh, Can you please show it to the people at home? Prince Harry would describe as an oscillating penis. Oh. Um, Todger. There's no Elizabeth Arden cream, but my cream is prevalent in my tight jeans. <laughs> wow. Um, I think the main thing you want to know about here is why I was dressed like God. I'd just ram-raided River Island. Great yeah. question. I've actually got corn on my shirt. It's corn. <laughs> big lump <laughs> uh, There was no juice. Oh, well, uh, other than the... I wish. 
flowing in but this pants. this is actually in Casper Lee and Josh Peters's flat oh big fan of Casper yeah. yeah not so much Josh <laughs> or Josh <laughs> Um, <coughs> and, and Joe Sugg picked this up. Your um, name dropping. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. And Josh Peters had fallen asleep. And I've also met KSI. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and he ran into his, his bedroom and woke him up with it in, and just, just beating him around so the head. So who just happened to have it in the bedroom? Joe. I'd, I'd say Josh Peters. Ah. Ooh. Yeah. Well, that makes sense. So I picked this up. Um, and sort of like held it proudly. Award yeah. at school so trophy. Like, was it Alexander the Great who pulled the sword out of the start? I, don't I know. believe it was. Yeah, yeah. Um, that is very much the Monday. Mm. Um, I would not like. We've to got Ale- that. Alexander the Great and Stephen the Mundane. It's cruel. <laughs> it's cruel. It's <laughs> oh, um, It's a hefty, hefty. It really is. Yeah. I mean, I can't. Um, I mean, I mean, I know mine looks like that. I don't know about. You too. Never seen anything Definitely like that in my life. Oh, fair That's enough. All. Yeah, you see, my <coughs> hand would have covered my penis. Ah, uh, yep. yeah. That's probably why uh, Jay mm. didn't go for me. That's upsetting. Amongst other reasons. Mm. Bless, yeah. Uh, speaking of Jamie Lynch, I'm not talking about the penis. Um, <laughs> have you kissed and made <laughs> up since his. your spat? <laughs> Still uh, not talking about the penis. Spit <laughs> on the penis was the joke, right? <laughs> and kissed. <laughs> yeah. Um, yet to experience either. I would say no. No. Uh, unfortunately... We haven't kissed and made up, mainly because I think we both despise each other. Ah. Oh, I wasn't aware of a hatred. Um, it's Wait, more... explain to me who Jeremy oh, yeah. Lynch is. I only know... <laughs> Say that, Jeremy! <laughs> he, Do you he's, watch TikTok? He's 50% sure who <laughs> I am now. <laughs> is he on TikTok? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, one word, Iron Man. Oh, is he that guy that, like... No way. <laughs> is he the guy that, like, spends millions of pounds to recreate Iron Man's stuff? Possibly, yeah. Uh, like, he's... actually accurate, like he's made a laser. No, he buys it off Amazon and displays oh. in his garage, I think. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Does he have a Lamborghini in there? Uh, I don't know if he... Uh, I haven't, hasn't mentioned that, I don't I think. think. So, wait, talk me through what happened. Uh, basically, we... Uh, yeah, and we I won't have on. anything from off-camera here. Yeah. Um, <laughs> we basically... We had a disagreement. Right. Because I made a joke and he couldn't take it. Oh. Um, and he... He won the Wembley Cup. You don't be in the penis and... Um... Oh, no, this w- this wasn't involved, oh, just to be clear. He can take that, just to just for the <laughs> yeah, record. For yeah. Maybe. Okay. Maybe. Gotcha. I've, I've yet to... Uh, once we get over this first hurdle, <laughs> right, I'll okay. get to the brilliant, second point. Brilliant, brilliant. This is what we're all waiting for. <laughs> yeah, yeah, of course. Um, but basically, he uh, I made a, a cheeky diss track on YouTube, oh, uh, pre, pre-Wembley Cup, just to spark the rivalry. Yes. Um, he despised it oh. and then despised me. Oh. And despite him winning the Wembley Cup, he still still wasn't happy. Uh, he sort of goaded me. Oh. And we it, it was just a bitter ending to such oh, a God. sweet game of football. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't think I actually kicked the ball, but I fell over. I was pushed, actually, by oh. uh, Jeremy. Mm. So he's a footballer? No. Mm. No. So as much as he would lead you to believe that. <laughs> right, I'll just pretend like I understand what's going in here. No, That's very sad. Um, it but is you sad. seem to be in a good place now. Uh, you yeah, personally. I, can't speak I, I got over man. it. I was, I was wound up for a long for time. Iron man. <laughs> but yeah, he, uh, I don't know what's going on with him. Maybe we'll speak one day, but I think he, he couldn't care less. Oh, well, it's oh. funny that you say that because um, Jeremy, no. he's, he's come to the studio. Oh. We told him there was some Marvel memorabilia, yeah. and he's on his way. <laughs> oh, bless him. Um, Did someone yeah. say Comic-Con? He just <laughs> came sprinting. You've oh. got a Comic-Con here. <laughs> oh, we do. Comic-On. Yes. I'm not a comic. On, on the pod. Bless. Right. Um, fucking stupid ginger no. twirl. Oh, God. <laughs> no, you're not. Don't be si- Don't no, put yourself down like that. But James you have to says have that every night. <laughs> <laughs> I left such an impression in my mouth. She mentioned me at a birthday, Yeah, she did. She? That was actually the first thing that she said when I met her. What's Stephen Tries like? Yeah, in person. <laughs> she knows. Yeah, 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 of course. Um, right, now, I know that you're not very good at taking advice. Um, that advice being <laughs> that advice being to stop drinking. Right, yeah, fair enough. Um, <laughs> what's that say? But can you give it? But oh, can, can you, you give, give advice? advice? Can you I thought give you meant it? like, can you but give can it? But can you give it? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I On today's was thinking. Show. <laughs> today's game. That is. Right, so, give um, Max. That's so you've passed your game. interview, but now we're going to do a trial really? shift. Yeah, I know. I, we're, don't worry, Somehow. we're shocked. Fuck me. Yeah, we're The bar is well. literally on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> don't look down, I know you want another drink. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. That oh, was very good, actually. I enjoyed that. I do try my best. Yeah. That wasn't even written down. No, it wasn't. Wow. The dome. I know. Yeah. Um... 
anyway, we will receive um, emails. Oh wait, I think one's just come through to you. Come quick, press quick. press a button on the keyboard, and it should just wait. More, it's a fun I think game, isn't press. it? Wow. Wow. Yeah, isn't it good? I thought I was holding a big hog. But, oh. Uh, that woman takes the biscuit. <laughs> 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 I thought I was one big hog. Is that really what just left your mouth? No, I thought it was, I was holding a big hog. All right. <laughs> right. We could put that picture away now. Sorry. Right, wait, let's test um, if we can read. Oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> Go on, do it. We never did this at Salford Unit. <laughs> <clears throat> so, no capital S. So Dumb useless hog. hotline. Another so. So pretty much, I don't know what to do, and I need your help as a last resort. It's a shame. I very much have a high body count at the age of 16. Mm, it is the number 29. Oh. Wow. Mm. I imagine that's probably the amount of people in the year 11 class. Yeah. Don't imagine it in a. I'm not actually imagining, Stop imagining. it. <laughs> yeah, maybe you should um, stop speaking about a 16 year old having sex with all the classmates. Um, sure, sure. Yeah. It's illegal. Yeah. <laughs> you can't stop me, Max. <laughs> <laughs> I've read the law. <laughs> I'm well versed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm well within my rights to picture this. It's been read to me many a time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not ashamed of it. This is their words. Yeah. I'm not ashamed of it. <laughs> but a lot of people I talk to are very judgmental oh. and usually ghost me. I am referring to people. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's that's a, a good step. Good, yeah. Yeah. At least it's not, you know, animals. Animals, yeah. yeah. Like, I'm in a relationship at the minute and he thinks it's three and it's been six months, oh. and I can't keep the lie with three. I know someone will tell him I'm lying because everyone in my life knows it's 29. Oh, granddad, I've shagged 29 people. <laughs> Come on, too soon. Sorry, that was just a little um, <laughs> moment for me personally. I never said that to my granddaughter. <laughs> well, you didn't have time. No. RIP. But he had 29 wanks. Yeah. And that's the reason she left him because she couldn't take the abuse. Have I missed it? No, I've missed something there. I'm oh. so sorry. <laughs> it's okay. I know it's going to come out if I don't tell him. What do I do? How do I tell him? Because wherever he was with his ex-girlfriend, whenever he was with his ex-girlfriend, he slut-shamed her <gasps> for having a body count of 15. Oh. And that's the reason she left him. Because she couldn't take the abuse. And now I'm sitting on a higher one. Oh, I bet you are, darling. <laughs> I don't know what to do, but I really love him. Yeah, he sounds great. Yeah. <laughs> if I tell him and he doesn't accept me, I will shag his best mate. <laughs> Please help. <laughs> mm. We've all had this predicament, I think. I mean, we've all Why been there one time Why is that the resolution? It's always oh, the if way. Oh, if he don't like it, I'll just shag his best mate. Say that. Yeah. Um, I mean, what would you do in this? Se so picture it. Don't I, picture I know it. that this is um, quite difficult. Um, on, you've girl. shagged 29 16-year-olds. I mean, you are 16 and you've shagged 29 people. It's hard for me to picture. Yes. Um, but then you have a boyfriend. Again, I can imagine quite difficult. No, I can picture that. All oh, right, fair enough. Um, <laughs> it's probably uh, easy. And then that Peter K comes yes, over <laughs> and offers you a university course. And sure. And take it. What is yeah. happening right I now? I don't know. Um, and then what would you do in the situation? I'm the boyfriend. <laughs> I'm so sorry. What would be your advice to this person? Um, hmm... He sounds insecure. Oh, whoa, don't yeah. know what for. He sounds like he's uh, threatening you. Oh. Um, in a way, because he's jealous of the amount of <gasps> cock you've taken. Ah. <laughs> Actually, right, they right, just said people, yeah? They didn't say it was males. Oh. Uh, he's jealous of the life you've lived. Yes. The amount of fanny or cock in you. Genitals. Can't have fanny. Sounds like a fanny in you. Yeah. I've tried. I mean, yeah. <laughs> um, but I think, oh I think. He doesn't sound like he's the one. No. You've got to remember, you're 16. You're not going to find I mean, he's not the one. He's, he's the 30th, technically. Too true. <laughs> nice. That brings it home, doesn't it? <laughs> a relationship built on lies yeah. is not a relationship at all. Oh. No. I was, I was often uh, stood at the, the sidelines during these teenage years of people having sex. Yeah. Just watching. Just watching. Very much a cook for others. Oh. Um, Just giving so, it a good old tug. Well, it wasn't good. Oh. It wasn't old. It was 16. Fresh. Mm. <laughs> but I believe that she has every right to live the life she's doing. Absolutely. Um, and and this man sounds toxic. Yeah. Maybe he'll grow out of it. You hope so. Mm. You'd hope he changes his ways. You Otherwise, he's good. Judge a body count. No. Well, the no. last to girl. A point. Yeah. <laughs> to a point. What is the point, George? Um. <laughs> well, it's my. 
Corby and Paris. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <laughs> it's an erection. Is the point. Yeah. Um, how, what is the? What, is, what would you say the point is? I don't know. The where, I don't know whether to... If you met a partner and they said my body count is this, what would you? What would make you go? No deal, Noel. I mean. If they wanted to continue shagging other people whilst they were with me, that's not the issue. It's, that's it's not the just issue. Their then past. I would then I would say as long as you're not riddled with diseases, it all looks fully functioning down there. As long as you love me, I'm. Do you know what? As long as you love me, as long Beautiful. as you lo- uh, 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 copyright infringement. I don't think that'll me, be an issue me. for that. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be surprised. Um, well, you actually have quite a bit of experience in this field, don't you? Because you yeah, the school field. Well, yeah. <laughs> well, your ex was Too sixteen. Much experience. Never had an ex that was sixteen. Oh, never had an ex. Oh, <laughs> that's where you fell apart. You lose a max. <laughs> Got him, guys. Oh, God. Yeah, that's why I didn't have sex for so many years just to get Max on this podcast. <laughs> You've been one planning it since day one. Oh, bless. Oh, God. Okay. Um, yeah. So I think in conclusion, if he is right for you, he won't judge you. That's powerful. I yeah. say maybe the the last gal's uh, poon was no bueno. Mm. Oh. Mix about three different languages there. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> I liked it. Um, I think we've given pretty solid advice. Oh, the this, phone's ringing. This guy hasn't though. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. The, phone was ringing. the phone was ringing, but it just suddenly it stopped. Stopped. Because That's I crazy because that never advice. happens. Right, go on, give your advice. Um, I would say. What, what, what is the cut-off point for a, a past lover's body I don't body think count? there is a cut-off point. What's the wow. age cut-off point for you? Should we, should we role-play this? Oh, please. <laughs> Hi, George. Hello. I'm sorry, I don't think we've met. Hmm. I'm, I'm the father of your partner. <laughs> anyway, tell me body count. <laughs> That's a good deal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you might be wondering why my dad's here. Yeah. Um, is he part of the body count? <laughs> I'd rather not disclose that at this time, Thank but you. he does have Thank a disability you. that um, unfortunately means that. <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> we we are con- we are conjoined twins, which is weird because he is my father. Um, but if you want to date me and then have intercourse <laughs> with me, and um, brother, yes, if you would like to have intercourse with me, just know my dad will always be watching. Is that an issue for you? Well, you say we're watching on the same issue. <laughs> is the... I'm blind. I'll never see what's going well, on. No, I'll just issue, smell it. How this pertains to body count is that every time we've had sex, it actually counts as two. Ooh, um, so yeah. we go. Up, we're, we're, it's quite easy because it's always even numbers, but it is quite difficult. When you when... say it's quite, don't talk about yourself like that, darling. <laughs> You're not easy. Thank you, thanks, Dad. Thank you, Dad. Um, but it is an issue that my his body. <laughs> Where are you going? Oh, sorry, please don't don't disrespect sorry. me like that. We're don't on a date. interrupt my daughter. We're That's on a my date flesh right and now. blood. Yes, quite literally. literally. <laughs> um, um, yeah, so my dad's body count also counts for mine. Is yeah, that an issue boy. for you? <laughs> um, yes. End scene. Right. Wow. Well, um, that's ableist, first of all. Oh, nice, Max. Nice. Um, and you didn't even let us get to the body count, so it shows that you're just very judgmental Shallow. and you really can't offer this person anything. In the Shaha. Shaha. No. That film is written about you. <laughs> <laughs> well, the phone's ringing. It's actually ringing again this right. time. Right, Stephen, 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 you pick it up and press a button and then it'll go on um, loudspeaker. And then you Wait, pop press, it down press, again. Press, press a button and Open then put it down. And then you put the yeah, phone yeah. back down. Put it, put it, put it right there you on. Go. Right, right, you ready? Three, two, one. Hi Max and George, um, I just watched a recent podcast and you told me to like get to the point and I've just come back and realised that it was 40, 56 seconds long so I'm going to try and break it down. So I was on, when I was 16 I was on, you know, a day <laughs> and a half. Was Eminem, so I should have been on because you know, I was only 16 but I was on it anyway and I really fancied this guy but he was 28 and he wouldn't shag me because it was so young. <laughs> this and is really clear. Nice, and he really wants to fuck me so should I shag him to fulfil my 16 year old's dream, fantasy, realness, yes, moment. Or do I just fuck him off because I really can't be asked? Are we sure that was English? Right. Um, I reckon I, they put the phone really down and went. I can't be asked. <laughs> <laughs> and so, 16. I can relate. I do believe that that was a snippet from Eminem's song where it's got the fastest rap alive yeah. in. Eminem, uh, Eminem, come here somewhere. Mm. Um, other Great than that, <laughs> I, me. I do believe that maybe they were saying that they fancied a man when they were 16 and they tried to message said man he yes. said, I can't have sex with you because you're too young. This person Boundaries. has now grown up, and this man now wants to have sex with them all the time. Mm-hmm. However, they now think he's a bit of a creep because he keeps calling them boy, little boy, etc. Thoughts. Wow. 
I'm just really good at um, reading I, between the lines um, there. Lots, I mean, lots to take in. <laughs> legally, the boy knows his stuff. I mean, literally. But You're calling him the boy as yeah. well. I'd say morally. How old are you, wrong. sir? Mm. Morally Two. wrong. Well, so it's a 12 year age gap, is that right? Mm. Yeah, let's mm. say that. And you do the classic divided by two and add seven. Well, it doesn't work. Mm. Wow, I I'd say, <laughs> I'd say avoid this man. Uh, run for the hills, oh. not the Hollywood hills. No, it's always the error of their ways. Oh, um, yeah, ev- the boy. That's not a sexy name. No, boy. little boy. Do- Ooh. Little boy. Mm. Trying to get involved. Come on then. Come on then. Yeah, let's get involved, Ooh. you prick. Did you say come on him? No. Oh, Yo. bit of YouTube law. Ah. Uh. I love the law of YouTube. Yeah, um, but yeah, that seems it seems horrific. Do, have they had sex with them? Based on, um, I, I mean, got T's and C's, they, but they, they want sex with them all the time, which would imply they might have had sex with them. They got a taste of that young cherry, and they want more. Yeah, Ooh. I don't well, think young cherry is a nicer nickname no. than the boy, if I'm honest. <laughs> No, um, but it does sound like a nice beverage that I'd perhaps like to drink. You'd want to drink the young cherry. I'm not. I'm not entirely sure. No No young cherry. I'm sure that this boy's young cherry was in the closet at one time. Though absolutely, yeah. Um, Yeah, happens to the best of us. Oh well, um, I guess we've not really given them that great advice. I'd I'd say the advice is learn how to speak. I would. I wouldn't. Yeah. Number one. You illiterate fuck. Great point. Yeah. Number one. Punk to eight. Mm. Enunciate. Talk properly. L- lose some eight. weight. <laughs> no. Wow. No, no, no. I don't. No, I don't. No, fat no. boy. <laughs> oh, bless. Little bodger boy. <laughs> um, my advice would be: hmm. uh, I no don't. I don't agree with the way that the man. The man's gone about it legally, <laughs> but I don't think he's thinking about it in the correct way. If, mm. it, if you're speaking to a 16 year old, full stop, it's a bit weird. Mm. Yeah, and, and I wouldn't say, "Oh, I don't want to sleep with you because of your age." I'll go, "Well, I mean, that is a reason." Obviously. Yeah, well, I mean, because well, I'm not attracted to of you. Of course, you wouldn't say that because you're literally young. Yeah. yeah. Um, George, what's the youngest you'd go for a partner? I was just going to ask that. The youngest. I'd <laughs> I was go. literally just going to ask that. What's the youngest person you've had sex with? Other than family members, I'd say the youngest I'd go for mm. uh, is go for <laughs> implies he's hunting them. that one. Ah. Um, is twenty, I think. Twenty. How old are you? Um, twenty-three. I'm twenty-three. Okay. Yeah, the older I get, which I think makes sense, I find myself having less and less com, less and less come over, less and less in common with. Sorry. Oh, okay. oh my um, god! What? What? That wasn't. Was that deliberate? Can't keep up with these young boys. Don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Um, less and less in common with younger people and yeah. I do believe that yeah. most people shift. should think that what are your opinions on Paul Breach I know you recently made a video about him um, he's he's just horrible well you've been <laughs> well you've been on some nights out with him haven't you so you can yeah well I didn't know I was you know the drinking uh, game <laughs> was, uh, was delicious but <laughs> long lasting I'll say that yeah um, <clears throat> allegedly. when did you first hear about Breachy Boy it was it was a long time ago, and at that point he was just mm, a I weirdo, saw, just a weirdo. Mm. And then as the months gone on, there's been more and more drama. And I was away yeah. on holiday uh, last week with him. No, no, oh. God, no, oh. um, to get away from him. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. He can't leave the country. No, bless um, him. <laughs> but I was. Uh, he will burn in hell. I was called up by my sister, and she said. Uh, have you heard about Paul? I was worried. You're in. Was... You're in for next Christmas. <laughs> they want you back. I was worried he was going to kill himself. Um, oh. And I was thinking. You Wait. Know, your you... sister rang you to say that she's worried that Paul Breach was going to kill himself. Yeah, because I hadn't put my video out yet. <laughs> <laughs> Get it going, Stephen. This is it. This is it. Oh my god. Um, but I, I don't think he would kill himself. I think he'd uh, no. use that to manipulate young yeah. people. Yeah. I think that he enjoys it too much to kill himself. Oh, I god. don't get why he's on a little tour of the country though. Because Cause he has to be. He's constantly on the run. He's a fugitive. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. Have you seen this pool tracker? I think the site's been taken. Is that really? thing? There, there was a website where people, he, people posted one on their Instagram. Yeah. On, I know, that's what I saw. So I was like, it's it comes more than once a year, Paul. Hey, there we go. Um, <laughs> but <laughs> like for where he posts on TikTok, where he goes live, like what he says and stuff, yeah. they, they build up a map of where he's been and at what time. Mm. So you can go on. And you just zoom in and you can see where he was in your area. And it's oh like got God. the evidence of how oh, he was there. No. But he does. He loves it. If I was in a situation where I genuinely hated people coming up to me that much, I would... The only reason he leaves his house is to, like, order food, go shopping. Like, what else is he doing? Order it online. This is it. You silly the, bastard. The way I see it is... 
like he's so infamous now that he's obviously not going to have to leave the house mm. without being seen. Mm. Yeah. Say someone well, like unless KSI, he had an invisibility they were to leave the house, they'd have the same thing happen. So they they work around it, whereas he yeah. just wanders the streets and expects it to be just okay. But he fakes phone calls. That's where he gets you. Mm. I won't take a picture of him. He's busy on a call yeah. with his management. Who who is his manager? Yeah, he's yeah, got a manager. Wait, he check has a manager. Yourself. Yeah. It's got management. It's got like a hub full of agency. It's what? mad, isn't it? That is management. mental. Maybe we should sign him. Ooh. Mm. Profitable. Absolutely. <laughs> but what does he do? Why does he need a manager? All he does is cameos. Yeah. I got a cameo off him. Um, Did you? It was awful. Oh. Really was. Oh. <laughs> I think it's because <laughs> my, my girlfriend said it's for my boyfriend. Oh. Uh, not my boyfriend. I'm yeah, of course. Quiet, yeah. <laughs> um, but the... Uh, <laughs> But but he just he didn't smile once, and I thought wow. it's because it's because she's uh, just she's, reminded you of yeah, your stand-up yeah. days. Yeah, <laughs> 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 <It's>, uh, <laughs> yeah fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> oh bless. Well, just in the nick of time, I've just had an email come through. Nice. So don't nice. you worry. You don't have to experience that pain anymore. Thanks. Just like your audience. <laughs> Yay! Hey. That was good. Yeah. Right, let's see if it's coming through. I will give him this though. He's got an insane pool uh, of an audience. Yeah. Twenty thousand viewers he had on live the other day. It's yeah, but a lot of them are the FBI. Yeah. Wow. Well, thank got, you. I That's... feel like I've got ADHD when I play with them. <laughs> it's all right. Enjoy. Put, the, put these um, on here. Okay. Do you want to read this one? <laughs> okay. Uh, this is a nice one we've got through. Hi guys. I just got fired and just got broken up with. Help. Hmm. Straight to the point. First of all, sure. Um, I think that grammar and punctuation. There was a comma after hi guys. Hi guys. Pretty illiterate as a person. Full stops. Um, Maybe they're in a panic. Perhaps. They'd rush this email. Yeah. It's a. It's it's more of a fax machine than an email, really. Mm. When it comes through. Yeah. Um, have you ever been fired? I have actually. Yeah. Oh, from um, where? It was an office job uh, for cars that were being leased. Cars the movie. No, no, oh. they didn't hire but me. But the cars could speak and they had eyes. <laughs> In a way, yeah. Right. If you smoke enough of the good stuff, oh, as yes. Bradley Walsh likes to say, oh, what's he the like? cars talk to you. Well, he doesn't. He injects it, doesn't he? Well, yeah. He, he used to smoke either it, all. and yeah, then he said, all. "This is not hitting right." Ah, the veins. Yeah, and it was just straight into there. Mm. And I said, "Brad, slow down." Yeah. And he said, "No, I'm I'm chasing the high," oh. and that's where the show came from. Oh actually. wow! It's actually yeah. the chase of the high, but oh. they cut off the second bit. That's great. Anyway, <laughs> I was fired for watching Wimbledon. <laughs> For watching, watching Wimbledon, Wimbledon on the job. Yeah, the boss's wife walked past me. Oh. So very much like this. <coughs> I was just watching Wimbledon on the computer. She walked behind me, saw I was watching Wimbledon the next day. It was my it was my brother in law who'd oh. got me the work experience oh. and then became a uh, minimum page uh, minimum page. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid shit, Stephen. <laughs> Stupid twat. <laughs> You'll never work at this car leasing place. Oh. Um I was working there for £3.50 an hour. Oh. That's the point. It's illegal. And that's the highest paid job you've ever had, isn't it? It really is, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's why you're here. No. Oh. I'm here for a good time. Oh. oh. A long time. That's oh. nice. I hope. I thought it was a job um, interview, but... Um... but I, no, I was... Uh, uh, she walked past and the next day, he, he, he called me up and said... Uh, yeah, they don't want uh, to don't need to work there anymore. And I thought I still did all my work for that day Jeez. and all the other days. Oh. And and yet the there was a woman who was working there who was siphoning money from the company. She got fired after me. Oh, oh. I got fired first for Jeez. watching oh Wimbledon. Oh my god! When did they let you off? About ten ish. Not really worth it, but um, I enjoyed know. it. Thanks, man. I, did, I enjoyed it. <laughs> it's good to know you weren't listening to my story, just thinking you'd be a <laughs> fucking pun. <laughs> Um, yeah, no, so I did enjoy how you acted it out because I was really confused what you meant by she caught you watching tennis. Mm. Hey, there we go. Yeah, sh- I got really you should immersed. have been checking your shoulders to see where if people were coming. Mm. Too far. Yeah. <sighs> uh. I'm upset. Um, anyway, yeah, so I guess <laughs> advice would be oh, yeah, sorry, the, the, <laughs> ignore the job, go to Uni of Salford, yeah. get a comedy degree, never <laughs> meet people. Easier said than done. That's not. <laughs> and then um, become an internet sensation. I lack the last part. Oh. But I did get the degree. Right. Um, nice. Yeah. I'd say, genuinely, if you do want that degree, mm. just turn up. Oh. That's what did they you... actually have to like, make you do on a comedy degree? Just stick on a Peter K box set? Pretty much. There's, uh, we had to do clowning. Um, no. No, you didn't. Yeah, 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 no. I've, I've seen, um, what's his face, talk about this, uh, 
Yeah, dude. That guy. Steve-O? Yeah, Steve-O. He used to be a clown. Oh. Yeah, well, no, he went to... I think he went to... There's like a really... Did he go to Sofa? No. Class next door. He saw Peter Kay's TED Talk. (laughs) He was... uh, There's like a... Because it's weird. It's like a sort of really pretentious clown school in France where it's like the best of the best do it and you all you learn about movies. What, what do right you sounds. learn about though? Like, what is oh. a clown? Know. So what we you did... You don't know. We did the kills. <laughs> <laughs> we, did, we did three hours learning how to trip and then look back at oh, where we Oh, was Bradley tripped. Welsh there? <laughs> he, was, he was very good. <laughs> yeah, that's with flying colours. <laughs> um, but he... Um, that was one lesson and I can't remember any of the other stuff. Ah. Uh, so, <laughs> so we oh, did well. that for six weeks. We did improv for six weeks. Oh. And you've That's got... a cop out for the, for the it person. Really is, Go on, guys, it? improvise. That's it. <laughs> that was pretty much it. Um, and then a lot of the stuff was just a drama course. Oh. Um, oh. Which didn't really work for us because mm. we were shit at acting. My so, I was. Uh, did they not go about... Um, so you did the stand-up by yourself? It wasn't... They didn't no, I just yeah, you... I just did stand up off my own back. So you did a literal comedy degree, and stand up was not any part of. That. You could choose it. Oh, but you I chose clown. Cho- no, I chose and Bradley Walsh. I chose. Oh God, what, what modules you take in this term? <laughs> what are the clown of modules? <laughs> clown it. You could do clowning for a module. Oh my God. Um, I did. When stand up came about, I said no, I'm not going to learn that. Because you can't teach me anything. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Um, Confidence then. Arrogance. Ah, the okay. Uh, instead, I chose something like presenting, something like that. Yeah. Presenting I mean, was good though, because they had Media City with the BBC and ITV. Oh yeah, yeah. Which yeah. is what they sort of sold the course on. Ah. Oh, we've got contacts with the BBC, oh. ITV, and the only connection we had with them was when it was Halloween and they did this. <laughs> This uh, scary performance, and we had to stand at a tram stop uh, pretending to be zombies. Wow. Because BBC employees very went past on the tram very comical. quickly. Yeah, that wasn't, is very funny, to be fair. It wasn't comedy. Oh. And it was, uh, it was the... Zomedy. <laughs> you need to... That was dreadful. <laughs> that was absolutely dreadful. So I'd give it a go. Yeah. <laughs> test, test the waters. <laughs> um, yeah, that, is, uh, that was the, the big connection we had with the BBC. Oh, bless. It was, uh, it's all right. Oh. They went past us on the tram. Oh, <laughs> you can do it in your own time. Yeah, <laughs> stand at a tram stop for three hours. You'll do it. <laughs> right. Oh, uh, so that's our advice. Yeah. For, Hi um, guys, I just got I, fired. I've been broken up with help. Absolutely. And yeah, I owe so much in student finance as well. Still. Oh, way, way more than I ever did. So it's twenty-seven grand initially. A year. No, no, Th- nine grand a year. Jesus Christ. Um, and and last time I checked, it was fifty odd. So what? Oh. How is this possible? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> what? So it goes on. Judge Rinder. <laughs> Send this to the BBC. <laughs> what? Um, but the interest on it just keeps on getting bigger. Why have you not That's just paid it, it off? Stop. I was trying to show them his payments <laughs> that were due. Have you not worked since the three pound fifty an hour job? I have, but uh, but it. But Basically. isn't it like once you turn thirty, you don't have to pay it off anymore? No, after thirty years. Oh shit! Yeah, so <laughs> or <laughs> just of life. Oh <laughs> shit! If I live abroad for five years, mm. then I think that counts too. I think, uh, oh. but I'm never going to pay it off. I'll oh. I'll have to pay it off. Yeah, but I'm never going to pay it off because it, the interest is so big. Yes, you'll they never can be fuck able themselves. to. Yeah. Oh. Did you two not go to university? I did. Yeah, you did, did you? as well. Yeah, I went twice. Really? Yeah. Funnily enough, clown. Clowning. Clown. Um, <laughs> clown. Funny enough, clown. clown. University of Clown. <laughs> I've got a name. <laughs> Funny enough, Clown. Yeah, no, you did sport and I did yeah. marketing. <laughs> sport <laughs> science. Stupid nerd. Yeah. Um, which is why we've been You did marketing? I did indeed. Oh, wow. Yeah. Nice. I know. Nice. There you go. Brandon. Yeah. Who's he? <laughs> He's a good guy. I thought it was Bradley. I love Brandon. Yeah. And um, Oh, the phone. What good timing. Oh, hold the phone. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I will. Literally. Where's press five? Mm. Hey y'all, Max and George. I am using a fake accent as I don't want to get recognized. This is quite embarrassing for me. <laughs> so basically, I was like with my boyfriend and we were like about to have sex and then he was like shit in my mouth. And I was like, oh. what? And he was like, shit in my mouth. And I was like, uh, no, <laughs> that's a bit weird. I think I just lost my accent. Anyway, and, I, you know, and then he offered me money. He offered me money. And I was like, um, he was like, kept going up and up and up. He literally offered me like 150 pounds. And I know that doesn't sound like that much to you because you're obviously like so rich and famous. I'm kidding, not well, you, George. Oh. Anyway, um, sorry. True. That was a bit true. mean. 
Yeah, I'm like, so I don't know what to do. Do I take the money? I told him I'd think about it, but like, mm. do I take the money and shit in his mouth? Because like, it doesn't really hurt me. It's just a bit weird. <laughs> anyway, love you. Love your potty. So love what you're doing. I think there's few things do that I, I wouldn't do for 150. Olivia well. O'Neill. Hmm? It was Olivia O'Neill, actually. Yeah, okay. she tried to disguise it, but she didn't do a very good job, did she? Do a couple of um, of you'd learn about that. I love how they're like, "Hey, Max and George." Mouth. No, they were like, "Hey, Max a... and George." My boyfriend's trying to get me to shit in his mouth. She, was, she wasn't Scottish. Yes, yeah, she yeah. was. She did go a bit Scottish. Yes, she was Scottish. Well, she, I thought she was Northern she Irish. Meant to be. I no. think she. I think oh. she. No, the, 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 the real it? Olivia O'Neill is Northern Irish. I think. Yeah, not the most funny accent, isn't it? No, I thought you were on about the less commonly known Olivia Neal who works downstairs. I didn't know you were on about she? the influence. So, yeah. one of she does if you pay her enough. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Maybe we shouldn't. <laughs> oh my god. Um anyway, yeah. <laughs> if Eat. somebody offered you hundred and fifty quid, think back to three pound fifty an hour wanking off to Wimbledon. That's what you said, isn't it? Um, Stephen, you read between the lines. Yeah, yeah. Um, would you shit in someone's mouth for 150 quid? Would I shit in theirs? Yes. For 150. Well, mm. I'd shit in someone's mouth to do it, but would I get the shit in my mouth? No, that wasn't the question. Too keen here. <laughs> Shotgun. Play hard gun. <laughs> hard gun. <laughs> <laughs> hard. What's, the, what's the phrase? Play hard. <laughs> hard ball. Oh. It's my favourite game, hard gun. Hard gun. Hard gun. <laughs> Let's play a bit of hard gun. Let's finish it. <laughs> oh my um, God. Hmm. How did the Illuminati sit? Yeah. <laughs> I yeah. would shit in someone's mouth for £150. <laughs> That's <laughs> the start of a clip. I was <laughs> just going to say that. I was just going to say that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but, but it depends on the person. It depends on the type of shit as well, I feel. So your yeah, girlfriend... I'm recently back from Bali and it's not... Ooh, no. A bit of Bali belly oh in the mouth. God, Ooh. yeah. So, yeah. I, don't want that, I don't want that to be the... The taste I'd eat in their mouth. Mm, it? No. no, I want them to have a, a nice fresh stool on a Thursday morning. Yeah, nice. that's always best Thursday morning. Um, what someone once offered to pay me to come and stand on them. What? Like come and stand. Come and no, just come and stand. Um, oh right, yeah, to yeah. go and stand on her. Yeah, yeah I sure. did. I, I did come because obviously that's well hot standing on it's someone, but I, it wasn't part yeah. of the criteria. No, but he sent me reference pictures tips. of people stood on him as he was led. On a couch. This is what I'd like. He gave you a brief. This is what I'd like from yes. you. And people were stood on his head. His head? He wanted nothing Can you else. Stand on a head? He was stood there, yeah. Like on like UFC things. Isn't it? There. And then I said, Can I bring my friends? And he said, Yeah. He, he was going to give me a hundred quid. And then I said, Can I bring my friends? He said, I'll give them all a hundred quid. What, you thought you'd make a party out of it? Yes. And we were all buzzing. Like we, to we got ready to go. We were like, This is going to be amazing. We're all going to work like 900 quid here. And then I told him. You brought eight were, friends to this. So then everyone was sat around fucking cheaper by the dozen three of us. <laughs> <laughs> everyone sat on the sofas. So like, oh, I'm a little bit bored. Don't worry, boys. I've got a motive. Yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> well, my friends were girls, and when I told him that they were girls, which was as we were getting ready to leave, he said no, and he blocked me. Ooh. But I do often think, save so it was just us. Heterophobe. Two hundred quid could have got a good, easy bit of money there just by giving a good step. You could probably message now. Because Max is blocked. Yeah, and our rates yes. will be higher now. 150. Ooh, yeah. mm. There you go. Mm. That's, that's good money. Yeah. Was it per step? No, it was just to stand on his head for like a good 10 minutes. Oh, you could step. That would be a good 10 minutes, would it? That would be a bad 10, yeah, be quite 10 a, minutes. Could you think of it this way? Could you Maybe. stand on his head a bit too much so oh. that he, he's unconscious and they just rob the place? Oh. And what's he going to say to the police? I never thought of that. Yes, yeah, probably because you're not vicious and horrible. Yeah, um, you could do that, I guess. Well, Just stand we try in this it temple. Out? If you're a criminal, we'll try it out after now? the shift. <laughs> 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 uh, it's, it's just about <laughs> when you say try it out. You don't mean now, do you? No, oh, um, but we could. That brings us on to the next segment of the podcast, where we stand on each other's heads. <laughs> <laughs> oh, temple! I just got what you meant with the Buddhist. Yeah, yeah I, there you I go. got it right away. I just didn't laugh. Um, That's fair. That's yeah. Fair. Unfortunate. Um, but yeah, what advice? <laughs> <laughs> weird nozzle. <laughs> so I thought when you walked in. Oh my god. <laughs> the tricky zip. <laughs> oh, a weird nozzle. There, you learned that in clown college. <laughs> really? That was, that was, that that was, was lecture one in clown college. <laughs> <laughs> you think your shoes were a bit big? Oh my god. <laughs> the the teacher had a doctorate in it. Can you? Can a you doctorate in, in clowning. PhD in yeah. Clowning. Yeah. Wow. wow. 
Wow, that's how, really how, how, how that's not me trying to impress you. That's me trying to show the extent. <laughs> no, don't worry. We knew, we knew that was not you trying to impress us. Don't you worry. <laughs> no one was getting impressed. Yeah. Don't you worry about that. I can't read the room. Stop it! Don't get impressed. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, guys. <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> um, so, what advice do we have for this person? I think if it makes oh, you uncomfortable, don't shit it's in his mouth. F- oh yeah, the they've been they've been fired and broken no, up with. No, this is mm. the shit. This in happens the mouth. to a character on Friends. They got really? shit in the mouth. Oh wait, no, that was the previous one. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you know, Joey, that's from a sandwich. <laughs> the one where Joey got <laughs> shit in his mouth. <laughs> You're so silly, Joey. <laughs> oh my god. god, it was a meatball. I can't do. I can't. Do, Joey. <laughs> As you said, there's a big audience. <laughs> Can you eat any more shit? <laughs> Cut that. Oh my god. Oh my god. I have no power. Um, yeah, I'd say take the money. Don't do it. Then break up with him. That's wow. just theft. Yeah, that's worse mm. than standing on someone's head under the I'd pressure. say <laughs> genuine advice, mm. uh, as I'm now American. Yes. Um, don't do it if you don't want to. Yeah. It's not what the Americans would say. Mm. They'd say, take a shit. Take a, take a shit in his mouth. You. They said they'd shoot up the place. <laughs> yeah. Shoot up the place and take a, a fucking shit in his mouth. <laughs> Is that what Robert you, De Niro would say? <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's yeah, just, so I think that's just think 27 you know. years of age, mate. Right? <laughs> <laughs> a bright light. <laughs> uh, yeah, take take the shit. It's an experience. It's a story, isn't it? Yeah. You know? What a story. Get back to us. Everyone's uh, shot here, probably. in someone's <laughs> mouth. <laughs> but they'll be here. Tell us how it was dropping a hard... Not hard. However, we, should be. we yeah. don't yeah. know what you mean. I think it'd be nerve-wracking. Mm. Yeah, I couldn't get it out. I think... Yeah. What do they call it when you can't piss? And you're a bit scared. Old age, fright, Being performance mugged, anxiety. Isn't yeah. that for sex? Um, maybe oh. we fright, shit fright, shit fright. Shit, you might get shit fright, and you might be able to shit not fright. push it out. Shit fright. Mum always used to say that. Copyright. Now she goes, careful, you might get shit fright. Yeah. That's <laughs> <laughs> a strange mother. Mm. Explains a lot. Yeah. If the wind changes, you'll get shit fright. <laughs> <That's what she's laughs> oh god. Well, um, yeah, I think I feel like we've given, but like, yeah, I feel like we've given pretty good, solid advice there. Solid. Oh, coincidentally, um, I've just had. Sorry, we're uh, oh, finally leaving. Sorry. Just, uh, clearing, Do you have to be somewhere? Clearing my monthly challenge on my Apple Watch. I forgot to read what it was. <laughs> oh. I'll never know. Oh wow. Oh, um, well, get out of bed, you don't worry. Cunts, do um, you? With this closing that information, because we company. have just had one come in. Wow. Let's see. For the audio listeners, what was I doing then? Uh, fobbing himself off. Yeah, I was. <laughs> fobbing myself off. I, I was just watching. <laughs> fobbing myself off. <laughs> you were just... <laughs> I was just watching. <laughs> go, now boy, comes, go. Um, <laughs> the, now uh, comes the time in the episode where I have to read, so please... Oh, um, he's awful at reading, Really? Hi, Max and George, and distinguished guest. Wow, they obviously didn't know that They've you were coming. they put me out with uh, Fermi so He doesn't even know when he's coming. Mm. Unfortunately... Oh. Wait... <laughs> You won't oh, see it. He's just done it. He's just done it. Do you want a he's tissue? Uh, no. Bless him. Um, <laughs> I'm proud. <laughs> unfortunately, my brother-in-law passed away. Everyone say, "Oh, R.I.P." Oh, I don't think that's the way to. I don't actually know what that what the brother-in-law was like. Yeah, yeah. Could be yeah. Well, actually, yeah. <laughs> glad. Taking mm. that out. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. yeah we're not pace. glad. Yeah, we're indifferent. It could have been bad. It could have been good. Brother-in-law, more like brother in the soil. <laughs> 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 We don't know that he could have been cremated. That comedy degree did well for you, didn't it? Brother in the urn. Brother in the urn. He's a good earner. Yeah. Bless him. Um, My sister is absolutely devastated, and since then she's been sleeping in my bedroom. The problem is that she insists on falling asleep with the lights on, with Big Bang Theory playing in the background. That's a big problem. This is all capitals. I can't sleep with the lights on, and I fucking hate Big Bang Theory. Amen. This has been going on for almost two weeks. I can't take it anymore. How do I kick her out of my bedroom without being a dick? Cheers, the Big Bang Bonzo. Bonzo. Pussy, <laughs> I did so well. I, oh. I think it was good. Yeah, um, thank you. Thank so you very just much. Just say to her, do you want to join your ex-husband? Ooh. <gasps> so the correct response is to say to her sister, do you want me to murder you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Big Bang Theory will do that to you. It will, it will. Is, We've all been there. It's the laughter track. Yeah. Once you focus on that, that's all you can hear. Oh, oh it's too it. much. Did they teach you about that? <laughs> no, no. We couldn't afford a What module track. did you have the laughter track? <laughs> we didn't hear laughter for three years. <laughs> <laughs> Just tears. Oh, it was the three-year-long course. 
Yeah. No. I they was really could have done it in one. I was expecting a, a y- one year. Wow. Uh, yeah. That is muggy. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah. um, just just, talking about just as I like graduate. <laughs> Proper muggy, this. Oh, bless. Proper muggy. <laughs> Peter Kay was at the graduation really? getting his own special little certificate. No. Oh, what a prick. Thank um, you. People think he's dying. What do you reckon? What? Yeah, he is on stage. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> no, have you not seen clips of him? I think I just because he's, he's lost weight. Well this is yeah. This but, is what I'd say. Oh, it looks like it's his uh, his last hurrah. Yes, and it's his last chance to make some money for his family. That's oh. what I. That's think. the vibe you get. Yeah, because the comedy is awful. It's not the best, is and it? he's he's sat I down and it. he looks very withered, and yeah. it looks Bless as though him. he's doing a lot of tour dates to make a last big chunk of money, which is actually very sad. It is sad. sad. Yeah, oh. cry then if it's that sad. Yeah, go on, liar. Please. Hmm. Scum you are. Anyway, um, what do we recommend for this person who doesn't like her sister sleeping with her? I mean, you don't mind it when you sleep with yours. I mean, when your sister sleeps with you. I mean, when you sleep with your dad. I mean, when your sister did... What? Sorry, what's Is going on here? Because that explains what... <laughs> <laughs> Let's just put it in the bleep here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, so what advice would you give, George? Um, I would, well, of going off the bat of you just accusing me of sleeping with my whole family. Um, partially, yeah, but also this question. Um, I would say, just be honest with her. Say, look, <laughs> I, look I, love, I love that you love the Big Bang Theory. Honestly, I do. Mm. And say, but I think it's awful ah. as to everybody here right on the rotten tomatoes page oh it's shit wow. okay um and then say speaking of rotten my husband yeah. can't, just can't close yeah. it apart. might take a lot of time for the tomatoes to rot to get this out that's funny yeah. um and then, <laughs> and, then I say, and then i say can we turn the lights out as well because i can't get a wink oh none of the girls like me uh, <laughs> What if she then says, you know, the lights sort of represent heaven? Oh. And my, my I'd say, partner. Melly's there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Money's I, I, there. Okay, well, bye, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. God, religion's not I'll, real. I'll, Turn the lights off. No, I'll say, keep the lights on in your room. You can go see him when you want. Yes. Yeah, that's true. What you could do is. While she's asleep, lift her up, put her in her own bed. The next morning, she wakes up in her own bed, convince her that she slept there willingly last night. Oh, yeah, do you not remember? You came and told me that you can now sleep in your own bed. That's actually quite good advice. Um, yeah. I don't, I don't, is it? Really? Put, put the Big Bang Theory on and the lights on in her room. Yes. And then, just, just, and then turn just it off in your room and she'll go... And just <laughs> walk towards the other room. And over time, slowly turn little, the lights little down. Little Big Bang Theory jokes on the floor. <laughs> and lead her into the other room. Or, or slowly lead her into a different show. Mm. Um, one that you like, maybe Takeshi's Castle. Right, everybody loves that. Can't do an impression of that one. No, we can't. Um, no. <laughs> yeah. But I'd love to see you both try. No, you wouldn't. No, okay. I, we, they tries, though. we didn't yeah, get taught that does. on the course. Oh, really? No. Oh. Um which is Bless. a shame. Yeah. Which is a real shame. I was pushing for it. Mm. Yeah. Um, but I, I would say, yeah, go get her onto a show that you enjoy mm. and a light that you enjoy. I'm talking maybe a, a dim blue light. Oh. Flashing red lights. Oh, What's yes. Going on with that? Like the police have turned up. <laughs> That's how Stephen gets to sleep. Not by his <laughs> choice. Sirens <laughs> play. Or a cheap brothel, George. You've got to think that way. Um, I would, yeah, I'd, I'd get her onto a show and a, a lighting that you enjoy. Mm. Uh, a a sort of a, a halfway house between yes what she wants and what you want wow that's nice. very good advice yeah yeah very interesting sincere mm. indeed can anybody hear that I can the phone just happens to be ringing those aren't police sirens um, otherwise Stephen would fall there straight asleep there you go getting the hang of it look bless him Hello. that's very good yeah almost uh, hey Max and George oh, I'm a student from North Yorkshire who's currently studying oh, at university her. in South Yorkshire. Um, and I vacation that, we in Central Yorkshire. get a lot of students from the South <laughs> and Midlands who say things like Bath instead of Bath oh, and all the rest of shame. it. Mm. In a survival of the fittest Darwinian situation, oh, the, the Northerners from. would obviously come out on top. Yes. And I really want to show them that. Mm. So, what awesome. I want to ask is how do I assert Northern dominance over all these Southerners? Thank right. you. Bye. Well, you oh, asserted your question. northern dominance as soon as you walked in, didn't you? You got your Gregs I out. I did. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> it wasn't a sausage roll. Yeah. No, it wasn't. That um, looks more like a pork pie. 
in both width and girth. Yeah. Yeah. And equally as tasty. Mm. That's not jelly. No, and crusty. It has a thick <laughs> crust on the outside, doesn't it? <coughs> Definitely permeable and permeable. very jammy on the inside. Thick crust, and I'm, we're spelling thick with two C's. Mm. Yeah. Every girl That's wants. What they call a you good. down the brothel, thick crust. Oh. Girls, girls go crazy for they the pork do. pie. Everyone wants a. Everyone see. The, Who the, wants the pork pie? People <laughs> lie that they want like a good like six, seven incher, but everybody really wants a nice two inch long, five inches wide tuna can of thick, unusable mound. Northern dominance. Yes, that's my favourite sex it. position. <laughs> I stand there. Dressed as a I chimney just... sweep, beating the shell. And I say, the this is this is for the miners. <laughs> <laughs> You're being made love to by a miner. Yes. I shout. Yeah, and they come. <laughs> that is lovely. I say, feel my lumps of coal, you charlatan. Oh. Hmm. And that that sex up north, mm. George. Yeah. That's what you're missing out so on. So, do you when I when we film this um, podcast together? This do you is feel filmed. Though? <laughs> <laughs> I know. Sorry, it's just a chat between three no, friends. No, sorry. Um, do you hey, feel as though? If it was, hey? Do you feel as though? <laughs> <laughs> fuck you. Um, do you feel? Do you feel as though I assert my northern dominance? Um, I wasn't aware you had any northern dominance in you. Well, I actually put my northern dominance in you, so that's quite a strange remark to me. <laughs> Take it, weird. Take it, you loser. Yeah, <laughs> I'd say I'd say uh, Max is the alpha. I I completely two. agree. Mm. You know that's true as well. <laughs> <laughs> you know that's true. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just bend over. Yeah, Wait, oh, oh. Jiggy. God, nobody wants <laughs> no. to see that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you've been asked a few times. I think you've asked everyone. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think there is a big north-south divide, and I do feel as though we're you know, building like boundaries to kind of yeah. stop that. I do often feel like I have to war. sort of dumb myself down when I'm the Nelson to Mandela you. of your era. You two. Yeah, that's how George always describes himself, isn't it? <laughs> um, I don't know if we Can't should. Can't do the impression. Yeah, no. But <laughs> the costume's on. great. It's, oh, it's not have. great. It's not very good. No, no, no. no. It's a bit offensive. It yeah. used to be better. Yeah. Well. Go on. <laughs> Used to be better back in the day, but then everything got all PC, didn't it? Yeah, it oh, did. I hate that. That's a fun. This is a yeah, fun running stop? joke, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. I don't stop. have a mouse. Oh. Oh god! Do you want to go down pets at home? I don't think I do. Either. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, back to you doing offensive costume stuff. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah. So advice. I went to a Halloween shop. Uh, not the other day. Oh. A bit weird to go. The yeah. Other day. Uh, around Halloween time, I think it was. Oh, Three right. months ago. Um, yeah. And uh, some of the costumes in there were heavily just wrong really? what do you mean there was a King, Kim Jong Un costume that you Seriously? could get a lot, a lot of them were just like cultural based oh. and I was like you can't dress as a culture no. how, how, how does a Kim Jong Un it came with a missile yeah what does what would <laughs> fuck off is it <laughs> like a big red button that sort of thing yeah, yeah. Did, did it actually <laughs> it actually no it, no, it, no it actually did come with a missile like, I thought it, you were joking it came with a blow up missile does it have a does a it have blow a up missile yeah not one that functions <laughs> Did, is, there, is there a mask? Was it just a suit? Because how? how uh, it was can... a a grey sort of like overall thing that he wears. You know the sort of like overalls. You know, you're not overalls. He's not in McVitie's like... factory, is he? <laughs> no, um, but he, uh, he's one know, of them nannies you know his... that knit shreddies. <laughs> <laughs> you know the uh, like thing that he wears over like the. It's like a all in. It's it's one like sheet of thing. I don't know how is to it, describe it. What did the face look like? Do an impression I using can't yours. Do the impression oh. of his face. So it's just the, it's just the, the hair. Suit. Oh, hair. Oh, okay. yeah. Um, He's got a distinct haircut. Missile. Yeah. Missile, um, and then just a, an outfit. Yeah. Right. There were um, other ones in there as well. There was like ancient Indian and stuff in there. I was like, that's just yeah, that's you can't not allowed. Do that. Did you tell that to the the shop owner? Did you kick yeah, off? Yeah, I, I, I tried it on and I went, this is wrong. Yeah, we've <laughs> <Doesn't laughs> got your size if you want it. <laughs> and she went, and I was like, oh, brilliant, yeah. <laughs> and that's God. where I went. Uh, it what did you go as for Halloween? I went firstly as a Ghostbuster. Nice, because ah. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Yeah, um, and all your friends are dead. <laughs> Push me to the edge. Yeah, sad. Um, <laughs> sad really then um, <laughs> secondly I went as a vampire um, yeah so I guess general advice can't remember what the question was general advice <laughs> great what new character it? go on 
Are we still on <laughs> shit in your mouth? I, can't just, I was about to. No, <laughs> we shan't do that. Um, are we still oh, on shit we're in, in your mouth? Oh, we're in the girl who, whose sister um, died. No, brother died. Uh, brother in law died, and sister sleeps with her. That was a bad description of what's um, going on here. That's tricky. You've got to be there for your sister in yeah. these hard times. Um, but yeah, enough is enough. Turn off Big Bang Theory. Yeah, and mm. push her out your bed. Absolutely. Absolutely. Do it in the night, repeatedly. Just say, this is what I do. Yes. Yeah. Can't blame you that. You can start going... <laughs> or yeah. um, what's it called? Night terrors. And then you could snore. Hmm? Say you've got night terrors. Is that a lot of cocaine? It's <laughs> <laughs> Dyson. Yeah. Um, do you have night terrors? Do you do anything weird in your sleep? Um, I can't say that I do, but I had a... Oh, my Legally. God. In, my, in other words, no. No. Yeah, no. My best friend used to wake up and piss in... Like, sleepwalk and piss in different parts of the room. Oh. Whenever we'd been out, she would, like, go over to my bin in my room and piss in my bin. Oh, God. But stood up, like, awake, and then I'd, I'd catch her, and she'd be like, oh, my God, fully naked... She's it's like, sort of like Tourette syndrome for me. You never know if they're actually doing it or not. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, she did have a boner whilst doing it, so I. Oh, I she think had that, Yeah. So um, I think that maybe that turned her on. <laughs> Stiff lip. No. Oh, that's oh, horrible. Oh. I hate that. That's. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm going to ask for Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> Kim Jong Un stiff clip. <laughs> oh my god, a stiff clip. Where did we go from it? Oh my god, I don't think we could go anywhere. For... I want the, I want a mug that says stiff clip. That'd be, yeah, that'd be nice. And the yeah. C is the handle. <laughs> <laughs> what on the stiff is before Finally, it as well. I found the clip. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, that's brilliant. That. Well, um, I do feel as though we've given great advice today, to be honest. Have we not really got another voice thing, or is that? No, that's all of them, yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. Wow. Um, do we clap? I mean, the studio audience definitely <laughs> we do, does. We do behind the cameras, yeah. <laughs> yeah, thank you. <laughs> guys, oh my god, don't worry about it. Um, we're here every week. That's how show normally Don't worry about it, guys. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. <laughs> um, well, thank you very much, Stephen. Thank you, guys. Do you First feel as though... Life. Thanks for coming. Hey. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> Do you think that this interview went well? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'll be um, honest. I feel like um, I've let myself down. Yeah. I've given mm -hmm. terrible advice. Mm. And, you know, I've I've upset the pair of you mm. with mentioning just just Kim Jong-un too many times. Yeah. It's, it's left a bad taste in your mouth, so I'm sorry for that. Come yeah. full circle. That's what you said to your parents after the parents' evening, isn't uh, it? Yeah. Did I? Yeah. I don't know. I, I think so. <laughs> to be honest, I don't know what the fuck's going on anymore. Bothers. Yeah. I will, um, um, yeah. But thank you so much for coming on. Um, I think thank it's fair boys. to say that you do not have a job here. Um, no. Nope. Yeah. It's the not search goes out. on. It does indeed. Feels like a side at some point, don't mouth. worry. <laughs> you had that answer in your mouth from the start, didn't you? You're never going to hire me. <laughs> Just here to uh, yeah, tick a box. Yeah. It's gingers, I imagine. Yeah. yeah. Stupid fucking gingers. Um, <laughs> thank you so much, Stephen. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> you are welcome. I recently if, learned that word. Oh, that's good. We could tell. Um, if you would like to send in a query, that's not a slur. Got uh, <laughs> hey, there we go. Um, please send them in to the useless hotline podcast at gmail.com. I think that's what it is. That is what it is. Or you can send in a voice note to the useless hotline pod. That's on it. Instagram, that's at the useless hotline pod. Where are, are you in the charts? Line, at the useless hotline pod on Instagram. Hmm? In the charts right now, I think we're like number like <sighs> fifteen. So we need. It's good though. It's, it's good. good. But do you Very know what, good. guys? It can get better. So, is so there <laughs> if you're listening, download, rate us, rate yes. us five. Well, rate them. Sorry. Oh, five stars. Yes. Thank you. Like a nice Uber driver who doesn't ask for a rating. Oh. If they do. Wait, can you give? Um, can you please give your most compelling speech to get people to get us to the top of the charts and look directly into the camera? Which one? The, this one. Both. The one, the one yeah. that's looking at you. Yeah, yeah, that one. Hi guys, these men mean well. Ah. Oh. Ignore what they've said today. <laughs> it was hateful and blasphemous, but uh, but they're good people at heart. Well, every episode won't be like this one. Mm. It'll be good. Yes. They'll they'll show their true personalities. Oh God. And uh. And post edit, it'll be really nice and tasteful. And funny. And funny. And funny. Yeah, it's like yeah. my nudes. Yeah. They're not very tasteful. funny. They're not they, tasteful. Are funny they are funny, though. They are funny. They are funny, but he doesn't know that. Yeah. I, I mistook it for a knickknack. Oh, you know? yeah. Right, okay. I, I, thought, I thought that looks cheeky. Yeah. I haven't seen those for years. Mm, I, I remember seeing them in, no. in Wilkinson's uh, mm. the shop, not, not the family. Get yeah. out of there, George. Oh. He's four. Yeah. Um, but maybe like and subscribe. 
like, like and subscribe. At, Sorry, yeah. yeah. You know, like and subscribe. Yeah, follow to, on to and follow on. Yes, and, with um, the sentence. Yeah, <laughs> and enjoy Max Belegde. Yes, and man. Nick Nack Cock. <laughs> How does he know your government name? Um, anyway, um, thank you so much for watching, guys, and we'll see you Bloody next Sunday. Longest outro on earth. <laughs> <laughs>